everyone hi good evening i hope i'm audible now yeah so welcome to this friday session now this is a free internship free data analytic internship course by the 360 dtmg basically internship project now let me start this session by congratulating you now you must be thinking congratulating you for what well upskilling is not that easy you give up when you try to upskill. But you are chosen to upskill yourself in the field of data analytics and data science. And that's the reason you deserve congratulations. Right. So now the question is, what is this session all about? This session is all about the free internship that 360 DTMG offers as a contribution to the data world. Now, as a part of this internship, what are you going to learn? Well, you're going to learn how a complete project works from one end to another end, right? Now, we all know, whenever we talk about any project or any field, you know, you must have studied theory and you must have studied it probably in your college or as, a, you know, as an extra course or anything like that. But at the very same time, when you, you know, when you read theory and what you do in project is completely different. The real world and the theoretical part is completely different. Right. So now what we want to do, we want to make sure that we bridge that gap. Right. And make sure that we, we learn what is practice in the industry. So for that, to bridge that gap, we have this free internship. Right. Now. Let's talk about this internship. This internship will have two phases, phase one and phase two. Phase one will have, will have learning phase, that is Python, SQL and data preliminaries, you will revise or you'll learn. Now, for example, you must be thinking that, okay, you already learned this, you already know this, right? So we still insist that you go through this phase and see all those videos that we'll be uploading to LMS. Now, the question is, what is LMS? LMS is our learning management system. And how do you get access to that? Well, you must be part of the community, right? Now, when you're part of the community for this particular project, you will be, uh, there will be a data, uh, there will be a Google form that will be posted, right? And we request you to fill that Google form so that our backend team can contact you and you can get access to the learning management system. Now, the question is, what that learning management system looks like? Well, the learning management system looks something like this. Let me show you. Okay, it's here itself. Yes, this is how LMS looks like, right? It's learning management system. Now here you'll, in such a way, you'll get courses, right? You'll get Python, SQL, uh, SQL data preliminaries, and at the very same time, what you will get is access to those videos and you will see three videos every single day. You will There will be three videos that will be unlocked and posted there and you will be seeing those videos. And once you complete those videos, you go to the assessment. Now, what you click on the link for assessment. Now, where it directs you, where it redirects you to our LinkedIn page. Now, here we have in our LinkedIn account, this is 360 DTMG's LinkedIn account. Here in this LinkedIn account, let it load. Yes. In this particular LinkedIn account, we post questions, right? There will be assessment, daily assessment, day one learning assessment, day two, day three, in this way. Now, the questions that are posted here are subjective in nature. Subjective in nature means what? Subjective in nature means you have to write answers in the comment section. Now, why do we insist that you write answers in the comment section? Well, when we talk about LinkedIn, it's really very famous for recruiters being there and they're active and searching for eligible candidates, right? Now, when you type something, you make an impact. You make sure that all these things Right, all these things, whatever you're typing is visible and you make 
your impact. Now, when you are making your impact, you're you're increasing your visibility, and yes, you're visible to the recruiter. Now, this is how it's a win-win for both of us, for all of us impacts. Now, once you complete this part, once you complete assessment, let me go back to slides. Yes. Once you complete assessment, and once you complete the learning phase, you will be part of project phase. Now, we shall assign an expert data scientist for you who has rich experience of working on real-world projects, and they will guide you throughout the project. Now, there will be daily stand-up meetings for 15 minutes. Now, this is very important. From Monday to Friday, you'll have daily stand-up meetings. And, uh, of course, there will be discussion of what is done and what must be done for the next day and any risk or challenges that you have. Now, we shall be discussing about this particular part when that particular portion comes. Now, upon completing the project successfully, you will get awarded an internship certificate or internship project completion certificate from 360 DTMG. Now, this is a free program and certificate is also free. We do not charge anything before, during, or after the internship. Now, the program will start from tomorrow. That is 2610. This is, it should be 2610. That is 2610, 2024. Right. Now, this is how the certificate completion, certificate of completion will look like. Right. Now, you must be thinking, what do we have to assist you? I mean, what, what else, what other resources do we have so that we can assist you in this particular project? Now, let me show you those things. This is our Page. Now, this is our website. This is 360 DHMG's website. And of course, you can see popular courses, Zomanetics videos, career transitions. You can read success stories. You can see your alumni's at work. All those things. Now, from here, you go to the learning resources page where you are part of the micro learning. We insist that you come here and learn do micro learning so that you learn a lot of things we have digital learning library for you where you can go and actually read those things properly right now once this part is done let me take you to another page this is AI design studio for machine learning where we have i mean architecture i workflow ml workflow architecture for a machine learning workflow or project architecture right from the one end to another end right from the data sources to the end user device also, this is for beginner, this is one for intermediate person, and this is person for person with advanced knowledge. Now, all these things are here, right? Now, you can utilize these uh, workflows, or you can say project architecture, and actually use this for your projects. Now, think of it. You, as a beginner, having knowledge of a complete, complex, or advanced level architecture, that will be really, really good. Won't it be? It will be right. Now, it will make an impact on recruiters. Fine. You have, now you have data skill assessment. When talk about career advancement and professional growth, we have resume optimization hub where you can actually optimize your resume, make your resume ATS friendly, right? And make sure that your resume is selected and you are selected for your interviews or at least to get a call. Now, after this, we have Talent Connection Portal, where you can see what are the jobs available as of now, what are the openings available as of now, from Air Prompt Engineer, Data Engineer, Data Analyst. We have a lot of jobs here. I mean, these are just few posted, and of course, we have a lot of jobs here. Some of them are not posted yet. Now, computed uh, conceptual understanding and insightful learning. We have mind maps or learning maps we are saying, we are calling it. Now, when you go to mind maps, for example, we go to any portion and of course it will expand and you'll learn a lot of things here like this, right? Now, this see, this is much more expanded and this is how you use it. Now, once this part is done, of course, we have it for many other, for example, we have it for Python 2. I'll show you for Python. For example, if you go to loops, there you go. A lot of things open, right? Now, 
this is part of time. You can go to Innovative Project Showcase. You can see a lot of videos that are a lot of uh, projects that are that are available. You can draw, talk, read about that. You can read about the business problem we had, objective, constraint, success criteria, business benefits, all those things. And we have animated inside series. For example, we have many such videos, videos and GIF. So you can just learn and try to understand in this way. Right? And it will be a really good, a good part of learning. Now, once this part is done, you can actually come here. This is basically a placement success stories, and you can just come here to playlist section. Yeah, there here you can see that you have a lot of videos available, be it resume building, be it project explanation, or our students get their research article published or research paper published in an international journal. So available there, right? And MLOps videos and Python programming videos. Of course, domain analytics videos. There are a lot of videos available here. And all these are free of course, right? This YouTube. Of course, if all these are free of course and uh, everything is for you. Now, once you, this part is done, you can come here and uh, skill yourself up, right? Now, let me revise this all over again. So again, we have this free internship project from our 3C DTMG as a part of contribution to the data community. Also, talking about the uh, phases, we have it in two phases. First, learning phase, Python, SQL, and data preliminaries you need to go through again and again. And uh, of course, there will be three videos every single day that you will that will be posted in your learning management system. How to get, get access to that? Well, you are part of a community. And uh, once you are part of a community, you will be part of a community. If uh, it's not yet there, you can go to the, you can just mail us, uh, mail us and uh, you can get to know about all these things. And of course, if you're part of a community, there will be a Google form that will be posted and you have to fill that Google form. Once you fill that Google form, you'll get uh, our backend team will contact you and you will get LMSs, right? In LMS, you'll get three videos every single day. You have to three, uh, see those videos. And yes, click on assessment. Assessment will be directed to the LinkedIn page. You have to write answers there. Once that part is done, we'll start with the project phase. Right, we'll uh, here we'll uh, we'll assign an uh, expert data scientist who has rich experience of working on real world projects, and they will be guiding you throughout the project. There will be daily stand up meetings for fifteen minutes, right, from Monday to Friday, to discuss what is done, what must be done for next day and any risk or challenges that you have, right? All these things you need to see. We shall discuss this when we reach this phase. Upon completing the project successfully, you will be awarded an internship project competition certificate from 360 DTMG. This is a free program and certificate is also free. We do not charge anything before, during or after the internship. And the program will start from tomorrow. This is, uh, this is 26th, 10, 2024, 26th. October 2024. You'll get such certificate after completion. And yes, there will be there's one thing that is frequently asked. Talk about frequently asked frequently asked questions. Completion of learning phase. Well, participants must complete all learning modules before moving to the next task. Please reach out for support if needed to interns one at the rate 360dtmg.com. There is again data science internship. Currently, only data analytics internships are available. Talking about LMS credentials, uh, credentials issuance. LMS credentials may take up to 24 working hours to be issued. Patience is appreciated during this process. Talking about internship continuation in case of emergency. If you are unable to complete the internship due to work commitments or personal emergencies, please mail us at interns1 at the Include any relevant documentation or proof and you will be assigned an upcoming internship. Talking about internship certificate policy, Internship certificates will be issued only upon the successful completion of all required documents. Failure to meet project submission deadlines will result in ineligibility for a, co for a certificate. Now, delays in project submissions are not permitted. If a deadline is missed, interns will need to join the next project batch and complete it within the specified deadline to qualify for the certificate. Right. Please uh, just 
fill the Google form and our LMS team will contact you, our backend team will contact you, and you will get LMS assist. And yes, while you're starting this, make sure you read a lot, revise mind maps, and make sure you rock this project, right? So yes, let's meet next week with a new project, a new project, right? Till that time, take care team. Bye, good night.